Hey guys, it's Misty Lovely coming at you with my week 27 post op update. Forgive me, I know that I'm late. Um, however, this will actually now be my official new update day. Um, I would have liked to keep on updating on the day that I had surgery. However, um, I have a busy schedule and I just don't want to have, um, you know, simultaneous videos all over the place um, of my updates. Um, that's one video that's been consistent. You guys know I update my post-op updates on Tuesdays but as of today it officially is going to be Fridays so get it right into it here um, I've actually lost more weight than this but I'll save that for next uh, update um, last week my weight was 306.7 and currently my weight is 304.3 for a total loss of 2.4 pounds this week and from my highest weight of 378.8 to now 304.3 that is a total loss of 74.5 pounds. Um, I'm actually to a point now where I'm ready to see more change, you know. Um, granted, I've lost a significant amount of weight. 74.5 74 pounds is, is incredible. And I don't want anybody to think I'm complaining, not in the least, because I am so blessed and grateful for those numbers. I've worked hard for those numbers. However, I'm at a point now where I'm ready to see the scale go down even more and see even greater changes in my body. Um, because I went to my appointment on yesterday, and I'll be sharing that video with you guys again uh, here later, um, of my fill. I got a, my third fill, um, 27 weeks out, so that's a little bit over five months out. Um, and I, ha I now have four cc's in my realized bed. I don't know exactly how many cc's can fit in this bad boy, but I have four cc's in it now. No, 4.5. 4.5 cc's. I got one cc put in yesterday. Um, but I was looking at a video of my body and I saw my whole body and I was like, you know, I still have a work to do. And I want to actually treat my journey as if it's still new. I don't want to ever get comfortable or become a... Uh, uh, yeah, like I said, comfortable. I I don't want to get I don't I don't want to get comfortable. Um, I know I keep repeating myself. I was trying to look for another word. It just didn't work out. So just simple and plain. Um, so in order for me to do that, I am going to start doing full vlogs for you guys here um, weekly. I'm going to document everything I eat. That means everything that goes in my mouth. I am not embarrassed in the least about nothing I eat. And I'll tell y'all, I had a case of the triads. Um, I wanted to try. And I just said, I was like, I did not eat no fast food for five months. Yay me. And then all of a sudden, my body's like, can I have some Popeyes? <laughs> and guess what? It was my mental. My mind wanted it, but my body said no. And I love that my body's saying no. It's kind. Of, I have to be honest with you guys, and, and a lot of you post offers probably understand me when I say this, is that sometimes when you want a thing and your body rejects it, granted, you're happy it rejects it on the, the, the weight loss side, but on the, the fat girl side that wants something every now and then, you kind of be like, man, I, man, why don't, man, nah, I don't want it to eat that. I just real talk, you know, um, I be, I be, I get mad at my, my body sometimes like, can't you just let me be a fat girl right now? <laughs> but, um, and granted, I'm still a big girl, but, um, I'm confident within myself. I'm loving who I'm shaping out to be. It's changing my whole psyche. Um, like I said, I take care, better care of myself. I go out and I care about my appearance. I care about how I carry myself. Granted, I feel like my insides are finally matching my outsides and it's just getting better um so i wanted to talk about tight clothing with the band because i noticed even 27 weeks out my band gets irritated still i'm not talking about the whole entire thing not just the port or or I'm talking about the whole thing um because it is a known factor after you get out of surgery your, your doctor will tell you not to wear tight clothing as it can make the um, port flip um, along with you're not supposed to sleep on your band until it completely heals and I didn't do that for two weeks I didn't I slept on my back on my couch for two weeks like low jack like my grandpa used to say um, really quickly here I want to give a personal thanks and shout out to I make this easy um, La uh, Lakeisha June 2982 free me 351 all of you three ladies are amazing. You are some people to watch. If you guys want some people to watch, those three girls are amazing. Not because they did my challenge, but because they stood the test of time. 
those women for 11 weeks gave their all. They pushed themselves. I make this look easy. Was in a hospital twice. She had her surgery throughout the whole experience as well as she was in the hospital. Um, on, I think, believe it was Christmas Day you brought it in the hospital. And then Freeman was sick as well. You know, that takes some gusto to do. And I have to be honest, I don't know. Granted, we never know what, we're, what we would do until we're in the situation. But on the outside looking in, I'm like, I don't know if I could do that. These women are amazing. I wish I could give you all a gift. But you have my love. You have my love forever. Like, you, you are three incredible women. Ain't nobody got nothing on you as an individual. So if you guys want somebody that's going to motivate you and inspire you as well, check those three women out. Um, also, too, I want to talk really quickly here about supplements. You know, a lot of people will tell you what you should and you shouldn't take. I've been hearing that a lot. I've had people tell me that I've taken too much protein. And a lot of my fellow WLSers have been to told the same thing. And I'll say that say this to that like I've said before we have different needs our needs are not the same you um granted like I said the body can only process 25 grams of protein at a time we need it for recovery we need it to heal after surgery um recovery in, in, in regards to uh you, when you work out um it also has a lot to do with your body's function overall hair has a lot to do with it as well um sorry for the glare you guys i can see why um what else all of our supplements have its purpose and you're taking them for a reason your doctor has prescribed them everybody seems to be a professional but your doctor knows what's best for you so if he tells you to take in as my doctor told me my surgeon told me 99 grams of protein you get your 99 and if you can shoot for higher shoot for higher period point blank um and last but not least, um, I hope you guys will join me. Miss T. Lovely is doing her first challenge, and I will be doing a video for seven days. Yes, I said that. Seven days of Miss T. Lovely and her kookiness. So, <laughs> I hope you guys will support me in my challenge and my endeavor to win. Um, there is a $100 prize at stake, and I would love to be considered for it as we all need help in these times. So, um, wish me luck, and I'll see you all starting Saturday for that. And then I'll see you guys for my next post op update, which is week 28 on next Friday. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. Happy weekend and I'll talk to you all later. Love you.